Hey, it's John. I just wanted to give a short update. Um, so this week has been uh, quite a journey. It's had some amazing ups and downs. And certainly through my, my work and uh, in my day job and also in reality as well. So you can see the world's going through a bit of turmoil. I guess it always is, but it does feel more this week like um, quite a lot of kind of chaos, especially in our kind of collective consciousness. And I've been practicing kind of observing that, observing when I feel like I'm pulled into it and also how to disconnect. So um, really checking in on my heart, trying to check in on my heart more than I do on my phone, which is quite hard, especially when I somewhat obsess about trying to keep up with YouTube and Instagram comments from you all, which is so beautiful. It's such an honor to, to respond and, and to receive. Um, but yeah, checking in on, on my heart, seeing how that feels and seeing if what's, what's going through me at the time is my emotions or it's kind of a mix of also the collective and when it feels like other people's, uh, like the atmosphere of a room or the atmosphere in a street or a town or the news or like do stay away from the news. <laughs> um, we have the news inside of us, right? We are the news. Um, so yeah, I do practice a lot of uh, breathing during the day and just checking on my heart and then really kind of pulling out any cords or disconnecting any um, kind of collective uh, burden um, that I'm being drawn into. Um, and also just staying as high vibration as possible, you know, meditating, resting, running, yoga, and, uh, of course, singing songs. Absolutely love it. Um, I've been again, uh, building up a, a few collaborations to, to work through. So, um, I'm working through some of those just now and they're so beautiful. And if you have, um, it's such an honor to, uh, to collaborate with people. It really, really kind of sets my heart on fire. It's just like, it feels so, so good, like bringing people together. And, um, you know, I always feel like I'm learning something musically and, and spiritually when I, I connect with someone to, um, to play music. So, so yeah, uh, we, um, this weekend, um, kind of Scotland and well, you, the UK is, is kind of on a lockdown. England is on a lockdown in Scotland and in parts um, so we're thinking of just going shopping today and, um, I might share some videos in our motorhome as I will take that with us to the shops and it means I can stay inside and, uh, record some music, um, while my wife and daughter are shopping and, um, yeah, looking forward to, uh, to write more songs. It feels like I'm making some good progress into album 41 already and it's been you know, it's been an amazing year to be able to write so many songs and share so much. Um, I just feel so, so blessed to have both the kind of time, the energy, the health, um, the, the focus, the drive and the beautiful support from my family and all of you who watch and are able to just watch or share or like or comment or, or whatever you do, just check in whenever you want now and again. It's just beautiful to have the encouragement and support. And it feels like together we're, you know, we're working together that we are raising our vibrations. And as others wake up, you know, they will feel, uh, you know, it's all different for everybody at different times, at different speeds, at different paces. And they will start to feel um, physical symptoms just like we have. And it could be anything from ringing in your ears, which I was convinced was tinnitus, um, which, uh, which a musician never wants, right? That constant ringing in your ears. Um, and I, I, I spent, I spent months trying to like turn down my headphones when I was mixing music. I thought it was that. And now, I mean, it's not to rule it out, right? It is a, it is a genuine physical, um, condition, but, uh, actually my, my ears have been pretty good and, uh, it's not really quite the same, right? It's, um, it comes and goes, the pitches change, it's a different symptom to, to tinnitus, to my understanding, I'm not a, not a doctor. Um, and then, yeah, also kind of just starting to um, feel, you know, different sensitivities coming online, like uh, being sensitive to, to energy, like feeling vibrations through your hands and your body and your face, your eyes, like wherever it is, and you might feel like you're going a bit crazy. So, 
um, for these people, for you, for all of us that are continually waking up and for those that are new to it. Um, yeah, just, just being there for them to kind of just shine a light. Like we can't tell people, you can't teach someone how to love. You can't teach them how to fear. You have to let them go on their own journeys and just shine bright. Just tell your truth. Just be honest. Um, you know, I was, I felt so, so low and so lost before I woke up about three years ago. I was, you know, I was drinking too much alcohol. I was, um, you know, I was doing a little bit of music, but I, I wasn't really, you know, into it. Um, I just felt numb and I felt depressed by all the kind of, all the lies in the world and all the corruption and how can we live our lives in such inequality. Um, and now, since I woke up, I feel so much more, you know, peace and forgiveness. I feel so much younger. I feel, I hope I look it. <laughs> um, I feel so much more um, alive and buzzing with energy and really wanting to help others. And it feels like such a different paradigm to, to just a few years ago. And, you know, we all, we all have the ability to forgive. We all have the ability to release ourselves, to increase our self-love and really to, to heal ourselves and just just to shine bright, just to follow your passions, follow your dreams, you know, follow your love where it takes you in this universe. And whatever other people are um, are going through, you know, they will they will connect with you if their their vibration, you know, is 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 drawn to you, and they resonate with you. And you can be a sovereign. You are a sovereign soul, and it's up to you whether you connect with other people and and how you connect and how often, and, you know, you should always come away from every interaction feeling like you've, you should feel good. You should feel good about yourself. You should feel good that you've kind of always stepped up a little bit in vibration whenever you've come away from talking to someone and you kind of really want to be back, like immediately (laughs) talking to them again. And you miss them instantly, uh, from, you know, from friends to family to, to anybody. Um, so yeah, it was a little bit of a ramble, uh, but I just thought I'd give a bit of an update. Um, I'm always doing John's talks and uh, always doing music, and I don't always take the time just to spend what has been seven minutes, well done if you've made it this far, uh, just to give a bit of an update on um, how I'm feeling, what I'm doing, and what I'm reflecting on. So so thank you very much. And um, I'm so, so, so humbled i can't can't think of the word so humbled by all your support and your love it just blows me away and i such an honor to create every day and share with this world so thank you so much for for being part of this journey and i'm sending my love from scotland thank you love you